Hey guys, it's Christina Marie, and today I'll be talking about the Holland America Have It All package. I'll explain what it is and answer whether the Have It All package is worth it or not. And by the way, if at any time during this video you find it helpful, please subscribe below. I'd appreciate it. Okay, so overall, big picture, yes. The Holland America Have It All package is worth it if you drink. If you do not drink, the have it all package is really not worth it. But big picture, if you drink, the have it all picture is absolutely worth it. Um, okay, now let me explain what it is exactly. And for this video, I'm going to assume you're going on a one week cruise because the prices and what you get is a little bit different for a longer Holland America cruise. So. Generally, the Have It All package, also known as HIA on some cruise websites, is usually $50 per day. It may be $100 per day. So it depends on whether you get the promotion that Holland America frequently runs of making it $50 a day. The reason it's worth it is that that's actually less than their beverage package it's less than the signature beverage package, which is $55 per day. And the have it all package includes the signature package. So for $50, it's like, why would you not do it? Um, so anyway, it's usually $50 per person per day with the have it all package on Holland America Cruise Line. Sometimes it's $100. So what does it include? It includes a $100 shore excursion credit per person. So if you plan on going on a Holland American excursion, this is a great benefit. It includes the signature beverage package, which is usually $55 per person per day. And that includes 15 beverages, which is quite a bit. Um, and it includes the beverages that are $11 or less. So most of the alcoholic beverages on Holland America cruise ships are $11 or less, but if you want the premium beverages, you can't use the signature beverage package. Um, it also includes the gratuities on those beverages, which is an automatic 18%. So that's a good benefit. The Holland America Have It All package also includes a one night of dining to the Pinnacle Grill, the Canaletto, or the Tamarind. So those are the specialty restaurants on Holland American Cruise Line. It does not include Nami Sushi or Rudy's Cell de Mar. So if you wanna to go to either of those restaurants, the Have It All package will not allow you to get in. Usually it's $25 per person to go to one of these specialty restaurants. So if you love the specialty restaurants, that's an added bonus. And then lastly, the Have It All package includes the Holland America Wi-Fi. Um, usually the Wi-Fi is $30 to $35 per person or per stateroom, depending on which package you get. Overall, I've been kind of disappointed with the Holland America Wi-Fi. It's great for maybe checking emails and the $35 includes messaging apps, but if you wanna do anything else other than emails, maybe a text, um, that's about all it does. I find it very, very slow for getting on the internet. So that's an extra bonus, but not really a big bonus. So big picture, if you like to drink, the have it all package is great. And then you get, I kind of think of it as if you like to drink and then you also get the extra benefit of a shore excursion paid for basically and to try out one of the restaurants for free. So big picture, have it all is worth it if you drink and we're planning on buying the signature beverage package anyway. This is also worth it assuming you pay $50 per person per day. I think for $100 per person per day, it's not worth it. Um, other people online say they really like the have it all package because they don't have to think about the cost of things. You just get your beverages included, you get one night at a specialty dinner restaurant, you get the Wi-Fi just in case you need it, and then you get the 
dinner. So it's just kind of like a nice thing not to have to think about those costs. Also, it's kind of nice with the have it all package not to get such a big bill when you get off your cruise ship because it already is paying for the Wi-Fi, the dinner, $100 of an excursion credit, and the drinks. Now, I will say it includes the beverage service charges, but the have it all package does not, does not include your daily gratuities, which is usually around like $18 right now. So this is for tipping your room stewards, your dining room attendant, and then other staff. So the have it all package does not include the daily gratuities of around $18, but it does include the beverage service charge. So that's it. If you thought this video was helpful, again, please subscribe below. Give me a thumbs up. Let me know if you've ever used the have it all package and whether you find it to be a good deal or not. I usually cruise with my mom and neither of us drink, so I've actually never used it myself and I would love to hear your guys' thoughts about it. Thanks guys.